Welcome back. In this video, we're going to take a look at your first skills you have to learn as a beginner in Blender. And the first skills are basically how to move objects around that are in your world and how to change the camera view, zoom in and out, and a couple of those things. Now, Blender is heavy on using the mouse and the keyboard. So there is going to be a little cheat sheet in case you don't remember all of this as I do it here. Uh, and then, of course, you just fiddle with your mouse and the keyboard until you sort of get the basics and you feel like you can move around the program. But here's the basics. What you have here is the world has started with a cube. And to select the cube, you right click it. That's right, you don't left click it, you right click it. And when it's right clicked, you'll see right now, it's got the yellow border around it to show that it's right clicked. Up here we have a camera. Don't worry about the camera for now, but if you right clicked it, you'll see now I have the camera selected. Okay, so let's go back to the cube. Okay, here's some things that you can do just with your view of the world. Okay, first thing, your mouse probably has a mouse wheel on it. So one thing you can do is you can roll the mouse wheel forwards and backwards, and that zooms you in and out of your world. And so that's pretty easy. Second thing you can do, you can hold the mouse wheel down and then move the mouse left and right and up and down. Now, if you do this too much, you might sort of mess up your starting point. And uh, if you look at the colors here, blue is up, green is to the right, red is sort of facing you. Okay, you'll see this down here. Blue is Z, Y is green, X is red. That's the default location, and it sort of shows you what it looks like as you're rotating it. This here changes. This is basically the way you want it. You want the uh, red sort of coming this way and the green sort of going that way most of the time with the Z going up. So that's pretty good. Make sure you can do this one. So fiddle with the cube a bit, a little bit of rotating, right? You can go under and above. That's all with the mouse wheel pressed down and moving the mouse around, okay? And the zooming in and out. Something else you might want to do is you actually may want to translate the world, shift it over left and right, right? So that objects that you have over to the side you know, you can look at them dead in the center and zoom in. To do that, what you do here is now we're going to end up using, let's look at our cheat sheet here. It says mouse wheel pressed plus control. No, mouse wheel pressed plus the shift key. So if you hold the shift key while the mouse wheel is pressed and move the mouse around, you'll see you get this. So I hold the shift key and now I press the mouse wheel down, hold it down and I move the mouse left and right, and you can see I'm moving left and right. So if I had objects over here, I'm gonna be able to zoom in there, and I can shift key, mouse wheel down, and slide objects over. Now, that may sound hard, I don't know, maybe it didn't sound hard, but once you get that with the cube here, fiddle around a bit, the moving, the translating, and the zooming in and out, and once you've got that, Check out the next video where we're actually going to fiddle with the cube and start changing things about it.